everyone. Thanks for stopping by to see what I am up to today. And today, today I am unbagging my Mint Mongoose for February 2020. 2020. And I've just opened the, the tape up. Let's see what we have in here. Okay. So we always will have our Werther's, and orig Werther's original. I cannot speak today. And we always have... Oh, okay. I have, um, usually there's a thank you card, but I have my magical mon mongoose, and this is my happy three month anniversary card. So every three months that you are an active member, they send you a cute little free gift. And this is cute. And this is a little bag, like a little tiny drawstring bag right here with um, all different kinds. I guess these are more, are these kitty cats? I would assume these are kitty cats with the drawstring so you can close it. So this is cute to put almost anything in. You can put your lip products in there or anything like that. I have uh, somebody that I met on um, Instagram. Uh, I think it's Bag It by Joanne or something, those lines. I will leave her link um, down below. She makes all kinds of bags like this for shoes, this size, for dog treats, um, all different packing um, suggestions. So, you know, when you're packing your suitcase, you don't, your dirty shoes, you have to put in first so the heels are down below. Um, she makes bags so that you can put things like that in your suitcase and not really have to worry about it. And I have gotten um, quite a few from her and use them. And I have a pet one that if I'm, <clears throat> you know, if I'm taking my dog somewhere, I just throw like their treats or their harnesses and leashes and few toys and stuff like that right in the bag cinch it up and I can either throw it in my handbag or just take it with me so I will put her link down below since that's kind of cute for that and then this is what the packaging looks like and it looks like we're back to the smaller smaller packaging let's see if I can open this without getting scissors which I don't know if I'm going to be able to let's try yes I can pull this off carefully okay and then this is what it looks like. And we'll just dump everything out. So you can see. Oops. Okay. So, oh, inside was the thank you card, which not many companies do this. And I appreciate this um, so, so much that every month that you get a bag, there's always a thank you card inside. Okay. So there's like a little packaged and then we must have a ring this month. So let me figure out how to open this. I enjoy the rings they're cute um you know just for casual wear let's see what the ring is okay this is a this the moon and the stars moon moon and a star and this is in silver which is what i prefer um this is kind of tiny but it's still kind of big so this is what it looks like cute i don't have to um cinch it any but you could um it is adjustable so you could just you know squeeze it together a little bit more if you needed to which I might because, um, especially in the cold, um, you know, my hands are smaller, but I, this probably fits just fine. So that's cute. I like that. Very simple, understated, won't get caught on things. Oh, this is heavy. So let's get this unwrapped here. If I can. Okay. I like the rings too, not always just getting necklaces and earrings. Sometimes the rings are really cute also. So then always, they're nicely packaged with always with her um, logo, the Mint Mongoose on it. And figure out these bags. I love the packaging because it's very secure, but sometimes it's hard. I, I struggle to get them open. I don't know if other creators do, but I can never find where the opening is to open these little bags. Because they're like them sticky ones. And I can see it, but I can't. Okay, let's hopefully I have. Yes. The struggle is real when you get older. And even if you're younger, it doesn't really matter. So then they're always like in a little bubble, like envelope type system. Oh, these are cute. And these are little moon earrings. Oh, hold them up. Would be nice. So it's show you them right there in silver because that's my choice and I will put them on my little little handy dandy little bust here like the jewelry 
folder because it is easier to see against something dark. Let's get the back on. I'm not always a fan of these backs with the rubberized, you know, the little piece in the back. Sometimes I change them out and put my own back on them. But let's get these on there so you can see them better. The ring is moving on my hand, so I probably would have to make it a little smaller. Can never see the little hole for the earring. So everything's black, so hard to see. Okay, let's get that on there. Then I'll show you what they look like. So this is what they look like there. And then the ring, if I can hold my hand up against the black there, you can see it. Very cute. I think it's adorable. Adorable. So let's, and I would assume this is a necklace. Okay, shouldn't struggle too much with this one. This one right away. Of course, my dog's down now. She wants to play. She's chasing her tail. So you might hear that in the background. Once again, you know, in a little bubble. Mailer. Oh, this is pretty. Ooh, this has got some weight to it. Okay, so this is a um, non-adjustable. I mean, the adjustment probably is you can make. Can you make it down there? Let me see before I try this if this is movable. Hmm. Doesn't appear to be. That could be a problem if that does not fit over everyone's head. I don't know. I don't want to force it to see if it is adjustable but this is what so this is the star and that's very dimensional i'll turn it to the side so you can see the dimension it does have some some little you know crystals on the front and then the of course i haven't seen what the moon looks like in the moon sort of is just a exact exact duplicate to the earrings and i'll put that on here this way you guys can see it oops this is heavy knock that right over just trying to straighten it out it seems like it wants to tangle it's, maybe we'll come up over the top okay let's flip these around i really have to pull it up so this is what it looks like i'm just trying to keep them separated so this is what the necklace looks like very very pretty it has some weight to it the star is heavy the moon is pretty light um, I don't know if there's one is longer than the other. Like I wish one was slightly longer. Um, this the, actually the moon is slightly longer. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. Um, I don't know. I will have to play with this. I don't want to break it and see if it is movable to, um, I guess it really should be so that I don't know if it is, it doesn't appear to to be I'm, I'm just pulling on it gently to see if it does move and it does not okay that's really cute i like that very much and um, mint mongoose is a monthly subscription for those that don't know i know there's quite a few videos out there on mint mongoose um you get to choose between silver gold and rose gold um each uh for your subscription for every three months like i explained uh, that you are an active subscriber you do get a free gift and i've gotten some really nice things i've gotten a beautiful makeup bag that i do use when i go away because it's a little wider at the base um, and comes up so i can hold a little bit more than just your standard makeup bag and so you it's 12 dollars a month plus shipping you get your three pieces of jewelry and they also offer mint mongoose black that's 22.99 with free shipping you get four pieces of jewelry, and I do believe they still do the um, the two accessories along with that um, subscription. So I love getting this just for the for the fact that usually this is um, a lot of like really cute, delicate um, items. And then this month, you know, the earrings are delicate, and the ring is delicate, and this is a little bit more beefy. Um, but this is really cute, and I don't think I have. I think I have a moon stuff, but I don't have anything with the star. But as you can see, like that is very dimensional. I love the little bling. So that's very, very nice. I am very happy with this. I did kind of spot a spoiler for this. So I was like, no, I don't want to see it. But until you actually see it in person, you know, you don't know the weight or you don't know exactly how it's going to look. 
And then for my three month, I got this cute little bag. So that was nice um, for that too. I would prefer that it be, and you could store your jewelry items in there, which I don't know what my preference would be for a free gift, but this, you know, if you um, like save these little bags that the jewelry comes in. So when you travel, you could put, you know, an earring or two and, you know, you can pop a bracelet or a necklace back in these and then put these in your bag so that, and then cinch it up. So when you travel, all your jewelry is in there. So that would be a good, good idea for this cute little um, bag to keep your jewelry maybe from not uh, getting all tangled or knotted and keep it separated. Um, I think that that might come in handy for that. That's kind of small for, unless you use it in your bag, maybe for your lipsticks or things that stand that aren't real, real big because it comes, you know, once you cinch it, but this would be cute to throw in your handbag um, for your jewelry or to throw in your suitcase or, you know, a little duffel bag type style and take your jewelry away with you. Um, I have a little tiny travel jewelry box, but this might not be a bad idea for, for maybe just for rings or if they're, if it doesn't fit everything, depending on how much jewelry you take away. So that's a cute idea. And the ring, I would try to have to squeeze that together a little more because it is sliding all around my finger. So that's what the ring looks like. Very, very cute. And I guess you can then move it around and put the moon on one, the opposite side and the star. So I love this. And this ring is very dainty very light it almost feels like you're not wearing anything which i like i don't like real heavy rings um and as soon as i made it tighter it stopped flying around my finger so that's good i mean i could open it up and wear it on a different finger if i wanted to put it on my index finger i mean i would open it up and put it down um could that make a good thumb ring i guess it could if you'd opened it enough but it might be too far open then for your thumb but it would make definitely make a cute um, index finger middle finger pinky um, depending on your pinky, you might not be able to make it, um, small enough, but I think it's adorable as usual, as usual. I'm always happy with my mint mongoose every month. And that's it for today for mint mongoose for February. And I have, you know, referral link down below if you're interested in picking this one up for yourself. And I appreciate you all being here. And as always, I look forward to seeing you all in my next video. Bye-bye now.